Hey, Jeff Labard here, winemaker at the Ganey Vineyard. I'm here today to pour two new releases for the White Wine Club. Um, the first wine that I'd like to pour for you is the 2018 Limited Selection Sauvignon Blanc. Mm. Sauvignon Blanc has been synonymous, uh, excuse me, the Ganey Sauvignon Blancs um, and San Ynez Valley Sauvignon Blancs for that matter have been synonymous with some of the top Sauvignon Blancs uh, in the state. And there's a reason for that. And it's a really, really basic, simple uh, explanation. San Ynez Valley, the, the warm floor of the San Ynez Valley does such a wonderful job of producing such physiologically perfectly ripe Sauvignon Blanc grapes. So there's really not a lot of manipulation needed as far as uh, winemaking technique goes to improve upon these wines. So it really allows us to explore the varietal um, on a deeper level and find ways to accentuate what's already there instead of trying to add things that it's maybe missing. Uh, as far as the actual tasting notes on this, uh, what I love about Sauvignon Blanc here, it's a very even keel Sauvignon Blanc. It's not um, you know super grassy green. It's also not super kind of overtly gooseberry. It kind of resides in this place in the middle. And again, that's due to the physiological ripeness of the grapes. Uh, what you do get out of this is some really nice kind of honeydew melon, nice stone fruit, beautiful minerality. And of course, as with all Ganey wines, you get a lot of really nice, vibrant, natural acidity. Um, with the, uh, the, excuse me, with the limited selection Sauvignon Blanc, you get also a little bit deeper uh, reflection of the wine. And what I mean by that is uh, one of the winemaking techniques that we use on this Sauvignon Blanc to kind of create even more depth and layers is we do um, some neutral French oak barrel fermentation. And what I mean by that, so when I say barrel, I think uh, people generally assume that that means that there should be some oakiness in the wine. That's not the case. Uh, we're using very old barrels here. And what we're doing is we're just allowing some micro oxygen to happen and we're also allowing the lees to stay in contact with the wine and stir it. Um, and that really adds some texture, depth, excuse me, depth and density to the wine. So you have all of those really pretty, very um, naturally uh, ripe characteristics about the wine while maintaining that really nice, crisp, clean, natural acidity. And then on top of all of that, you have some nice depth and layers to it. Uh, the 2018 Limited Selection Sauvignon Blanc it's tasting beautifully right now. I'm sure it's going to be even better when you get it. Cheers. Delicious. Uh, the second wine that I wanted to pour for you today is the 2018 Limited Selection Chardonnay. So this Chardonnay is really, um, really unique. It's, it's, it's a beautiful wine. Um, it actually comes from two of our uh, estate vineyards that are in the Santa Rita Hills Appalachian. So I believe this vintage is about three quarters Evans Ranch and about one quarter Esperanza. And this gives me a little bit of a chance to brag about what great fruit that we are able to uh, get here at Ganey. So Evans Ranch, as you may or may not know, is uh, one of our Vineyard Properties in the Santa Rita Hills Appalachian. It's located on the southeast corridor of the Santa Rita Hills ADA. Uh, it's primarily dedicated to Chardonnay and Pinot Noir with a little bit of Syrah. The other vineyard is our Esperanza Vineyard. Esperanza is in the northwest corridor. And for anybody that knows Santa Rita Hills, I think you'll know that Santa Rita Hills is a very, very small Appalachian. But it also happens to be an incredibly diverse Appalachian within itself. And what I mean by that is you get these really dramatic topographical changes from the North Corridor to the Southern Corridor, and especially as you go East and West as well. The Esperanza Vineyard has very shallow, sandy soils, whereas the Evans Ranch uh, Vineyard has, it transitions away from uh, sand and is more of a clay soil vineyard. So we get these wines from Evans Ranch, I think, that are a little bit more stood up. And people always ask me, what does stood up mean? Well, stood up to me means the wine has a little bit more uh, structure to it. And where Esperanza really blends in beautifully with that is that Esperanza 
has this really, really vibrant, natural, beautiful acidity. So you're kind of combining um, something that has brawn, we call Evans Ranch in this case, we'll call that the brawn, and then you kind of the youthfulness or the beauty um, characteristic kind of comes in from Esperanza. So the Chardonnay, absolutely phenomenal. 100% um, malolactic complete. We age this in about 30% new French oak. 100% of it is barrel fermented and aged, but about 30% of those barrels are new French. So again, we have some spice in this wine, but it shouldn't be overt. It shouldn't be um, out of bounds in any way. There's a really nice amount of spice that really complements the natural stone fruit um, and uh, minerality that we get from our, our uh, vineyards out there. So that's the 2018 limited selection Chardonnay. Cheers. Delicious. And I just wanna remind everybody, uh, if you love these wines, you absolutely have to have them. We're running a special right now. If you reorder them uh, through the end of the month, we'll give you a 30% off. Cheers and have a great day.